Hello, I'm Mike Russell from musicradiocreative.com. In this video, we'll look at the multiband compressor and how to use it in Adobe Audition. If you're enjoying the videos I'm making, do be sure to hit the like button on this one. Also, if you haven't done so, subscribe and make sure you ding the bell so you never miss another audio production tutorial from me. Now I've got a jingle here. Broadcasting coast to coast. It's the Michael Love Show on Mix FM. It sounds good, but multiband compression can really finalize it and make it pop out of the speakers, particularly if you're using this jingle on internet radio and there's no compression going out or no finalizing going out on the stream that you're sending out. You want those jingles to sound as big and as loud as they possibly can. Multiband compression brings all of that and more. It's also good if you're making demo tapes and you want to make it sound like you've been on broadcast radio. Uh, you can do all of that using multiband compressor. So let me show it to you and some of my favorite presets. It sounds like amplitude and compression, multiband compressor. Here it is. And my favorite, favorite preset is broadcast. Hit this one and you'll see also in the preview window, the after, it's very, very smashed. Let's listen. Broadcasting yeah. coast to coast. It's the Michael Love Show on Mix FM. Compared to before. Broadcasting coast. So you can hear it's really pumped it up and added some punch to it. So what's it doing? Let's look at the um, lights lighting up as if we play back. Broadcasting coast to coast. So you can see it's working on each frequency band and compressing it on a different basis. We can solo those using S. So that's the bass getting compressed. Low mids. Broadcasting. And then high mids. Broadcasting. And then, of course, the high end. So there you go. You've got all of that all working in tandem. And, of course, the more we can press apart, the more it uh, pulls out of the mix. Broadcasting coast to coast. It's the mic. You see, now it's very uh, bass light if I pull that out of the mix. The same with the treble if I pull that down. Broadcast. Lots of gain reduction on the high end, so it's not shining through. You've also got this limiter. It's like a brick wall limiter uh, that if you switch on, will make sure that the audio is crushed down even further. Broadcasting coast to coast. It's the but I tend to leave that off. The other effect or preset I really like in here is called Pop Master. This one also does a great job. Broadcasting coast to coast. It's the Michael Love Show on Mix FM. And I find that a little crunchier than the broadcast, but it really is a matter of taste. But both Pop Master and Broadcast are two fantastic presets. You can, of course, change these frequency bands so that you're working in different areas. It really is your choice. Uh, but it's a great preset, a great effect in Adobe Audition if you really want to finalize audio and make it sound as loud and crunchy as possible multiband compressor is the way to go. And if you want to learn more about all these effects and use them yourself in a multi-track session of Adobe Audition, I have presets that combine them all together so you can easily make jingles without needing to set up a new template every time. Just check them out at mrc.fm forward slash presets. That is mrc.fm forward slash presets. 